Okay, so not having it in the Game Caviar studios, I know what you're, what you're wondering right now. Whose voice is that? Where'd that voice come from? Well, I recently got introduced to this website called Fiverr.com. That's 5RR.com. Basically, what it is, it's a website that allows people to sell services for $5. Now, there's a lot of things on this website, and if you are a fellow YouTube commentator, I would definitely... Um, suggest you check it out as soon as possible now you got things like people do voiceovers YouTube intros uh, just intros not for YouTube but just intros for businesses and everything like that it's a lot of weird things like people were offering psychic readings and everything but uh, where I came into the mix I needed I wanted to have a more serious professional sound a sound that was remember like they, that you can remember when you heard it I wanted somebody to do an intro for game caviar but I didn't want just any regular person I wanted the, the somebody that sounded like the voice that you hear on movie trailers and once I found Fiverr I started searching around and I came across the guy his username is Mike's microphone and he hooked me up now I ordered the service on July 4th the holiday and he had it to me the next day that's how quick it is not everybody on the website is going to be able to provide that service that quick but for uh, for me it did happen that quick and I, I couldn't have asked for more now I paid ten dollars because I had an intro and an outro so I paid the extra of five dollars for a gig but he recorded two variations of the intro and two variations of the outro so I feel as though I got my money's work it sounds very professional and I'm very happy with it so again Fiverr.com that's 5RR.com check it out the guy that I use to make the intro and outro is his username is Mike's microphone and he definitely does really good work and is very fast and professional so the game that I'm playing right now if you don't know is Homefront and I'm using my overly flamboyant ACR. Now this game is kind of different from what you would expect from current gen online shooters. Uh, it has some sort of, uh, it takes from Counter-Strike where you can buy special weapons and flag vests, uh, more than just your regular gun. Uh, it has some, an, in, an in-match currency is what I like to call it. Uh, the more you kill people, the more points you get, and you can use those credits towards, you know, like I said, flag vests, RPG, Hellfire missiles, helicopters, uh, tanks, everything. In a few minutes, I got pissed off, and I got into my tank, and then I started, you know, doing my thing. I started, I, I hopped into my tank, bruh, and you'll see it here in a minute. But anyway, they're coming out with a sequel to this game. I'm eagerly awaiting for this sequel. If you are looking for something that's different to play online and you want to break the monotony of uh, Call of Duty and, and or Battlefield 3, try Homefront. It's really cheap right now because it's been out for a while and if you catch it just right, I think GameStop is still having that buy one, get one, uh, buy two, get one free on pre-owned pre games. So you might be able to get this for a really low price if not free. So I would definitely check it out. But let me warn you, if you want to level up past level 5 on in multiplayer online, you have to buy a code, and I believe that code is $5. Now, uh, right here, I hop into my tank, bruh, and let me see here. In a minute, somebody's going to want to tank off. This guy down there, you see him right there? He wants to tank off. You want to fight my tank, bruh? Let's fight tanks, bruh. I mean, you pretty much, I kept it in a video because you know how it's going to end. You can't just fight me in the tank, okay? Especially after I'm pissed off because this other team, they just been, they were just whoring out the vehicles, the tanks, the helicopters. I was like, no, screw this. I unlocked the tank. Guess what? I'm using the tank, bruh. Anyway, yeah, this, this multiplayer has a lot of, a lot of things to offer. The vehicles, the, the, the currency, 
the just it, it takes the fast-paced nature from Call of Duty and it takes the vehicles from Battlefield and it really mixes them together very well it takes the lag from Call of Duty and it also sprinkles that in a little bit uh, not nah, I mean that was a joke for it Call of Duty Battlefield has lag too so uh, uh, Modern Warfare 3 is really known for its lag so I'm gonna say that they took the lag from Call of Duty anyway um, of course uh, game caviar is getting better and better every day uh, I'm going to be I'm collecting stories for the news uh, tomorrow and it's gonna have a new look I'm gonna buy a nice HD webcam either tomorrow or within the next two weeks that's gonna give it a better look I already bought the blue snowball microphone which I'm using right now and I'm getting used to it so everything is coming together I'm starting to get the guys more incorporated into it so please like comment subscribe spread the word I'm not having it and I'm out. This has been a Game Caviar production. Like this video and subscribe for more.